What's going on guys? CJT here. Just wanted to do a recap video on the 24 hour Minecraft stream me and the Paladin did the other day. I hope you guys were there. Check us out on Twitch. So we did a challenge to stay up and play money Minecraft 24 hour stream and I'll say first feeling I had was that I felt like complete dog shit. <laughs> I was so tired and my body was fighting me on everything. But it was worth it in the end, and I had a lot of fun, so... This was our spawn point. We spawned generally just middle of nowhere, but there was a village nearby. There was a temple that way, there was a temple here. You can see we've done a lot of work to this world down, destroyed most of the shit that wasn't ours, so... I'll take a quick, I'll take a quick adventure over to where I first started my base. Now the paladin went around and he played like a nomad for the first few days and I like to base up real quick, so we're gonna head there now. As I was trying to find a nice area to go, I came across this little micro village and this temple was the first place I went and I got not that much good shit, I got an iron pickaxe and I started, came over here, destroyed some trees and made my way to this little hole. Now I made this hole. This hole was my first house, you could say. And I loved it to the end of my life. By the end of my life, for like five minutes, and I booked it, because I fucking hated living in a hole. There's a little village over there, but it was real fucked up, so I, I didn't mess with it too much. But this was my house. This little shack where there's two furnaces, a uh, crafting table, and two double chests, and that's all I had to my name. And I went down with some mining and stuff, nothing too fancy, but that's where I began my start to the world. Now I'm gonna build up and fly over to where the main action is. So again, that's that little village. We have some rails going between them because we started stealing a bunch of villagers, because the one village we settled up near was empty, and all of them died. So as you can see here, this is the Paladin's base. It was originally someone else's, but we took it over and made it our own. We had a guest come on the stream and hang out with us. We had a nice flyby of his house. Nice castle right here. And there's this quarry out of the back. All crazy and shit. <sighs> My base was originally one of those sand temples, and I've kind of kept to the same theme. I took out all the sandstone in it because I hate that look. But I put it all with the smooth sandstone. But I kind of refurbished a Minecraft temple and I turned it into my own. So this is my place, my farms, because this villager we had would buy books and kind of just made it my own chest and shit nothing too fancy down here's my ways my mind nice drop and me and the uh, paladin's quarry we both sync up so it's actually kind of nice stairs on both sides just go up nothing really you can go outside don't have any doors i used to not have doors we have our nether it's not really Special, just looks like another, and as you can see, I kind of forgot railings there, but we won't tell anyone. Go down this way, it's just the next place, but as you can see, keep going down. This is where we do all our enchantment, but I didn't fill in all the books, but I still can get those nice level 30 enchants, so works for me. Now, my bed kept moving all over the place, but that was like the final spot I chose, and down here, I just got a little AFK um, sugar cane farm. Well, it looks like it's been doing pretty well. I've only been on for a few minutes, so. Probably like 10 minutes. Yeah, it just works. Over here is one of the, the one village that was empty, and we decided to make a condo complex for this. This was like the Paladin's big project. We still want to expand it. We're still probably going to play this world, but you can see. He did most of this, but we flattened out the area, 
We got some villagers. Don't talk to me. Nah, fuck leather workers. But we do have a few good guys. One guy with a mending book. Let's see if he's out here real quick. I don't see him. He's probably just hiding like a little fucking bastard. But it's all right. It's probably this fuck. He got away today. But this is our little village, our condo complex. Oh, I'm trying to leech her over this fence. <laughs> yes. I love the elytra because it's so glitchy. But this is part of us trying to flatten it out. Little horse stable for the horse that I accidentally killed. <laughs> And I just want to go over this. This is the big thank you sign. And there's the Palda himself. This is a big thank you sign for all those that came on the stream and helped out. The big thank you for the Palda for sticking with me for 24 hours straight playing Minecraft. Gotta thank Frustrated Unix, also known as Frustrated PC. He was, um, he came over, visited me, made sure I was alive. But he also was on the stream for a long time and he promoted the stream, which was really nice. Got Super Indian Cow, which was the guy that previously had a house there and decided to build a tall tower, jump off, and kill himself, and ride away into the ocean. So it was good to have him on the server, though. Good guest star. And then all of these people. Some people I know, some people I don't know, but I want to thank everyone that kept came on the stream and talked to me, helped promote it. And just a big thanks to you all. Even you on YouTube, I. Hope some of you guys came from the channel and watched it on the stream, but that's all I got for you today. Thanks for watching. Catch you later in the next video. Peace out.